the other defect of the power of accommodation is hypermetropia well this is a fancy word right it's nothing but the long sightedness long sightedness is a defect where a person can see the farther objects very clearly but he cannot see the nearer objects clearly it means the near point of the person's eyes has been shifted somewhere near to the point or farther to the point let's see what happens now let's consider the eyes this is the near point of the eyes but the near point has been shifted to some other point now what happens the light rays comes hits the cornea right and then the image formation should be on retina but it's not happening there it is happening somewhere behind the retina so the image is not clear for the person this is due to the focal length of the lens if the focal length of the lens becomes too long then this defect happens and even if the eyeball becomes smaller then also this defects will arise how can we correct this we can use a convex lens let's use a convex lens here let's consider the eye convex lens what happens in the convex lens it converges the light right yes the light rays come from the near point it converges here so even cornea converges there is double converging happening and then the image will be formed on the retina this is how hypermetropia or the long sightedness can be recovered the other refractive defect is called presbyopia this presbyopia is a defect which may arise after 30 or 40 years here the ciliary muscles will lose its ability to change the shape of the lens that we have thereby they lose the capacity to change the focal length of this lens even this can be corrected this can be corrected by the lens called bifocal lens the bifocal lens will be having the combination of convex lens and the concave lens they both will be merged into a lens so that the person can see the farther object as well as the nearer object there is another defect which is nowhere related to the power of accommodation that is called the cataract cataract is the defect of the eyes when the lens which is crystalline become cloudy even this problem can be solved by a surgery called cataract surgery this is all about our eyes in the next class we are going to explore the colorful world and why it is looking so colorful to us